LSU is home to around 1,200 oak trees, but after Baton Rouge battled an icy winter storm, many branches and even entire trees fell in and around LSU's campus. News reporter Alon Valdivieso has the story. Last week's winter storm caused many branches and trees to become damaged and in some cases completely snap. LSU student Reese Biggs found out through her sorority group chat that an entire tree had fallen onto her car due to the storm. I called LSU PD, see if they could help. I heard that they had like chainsaws and they were going around campus like trying to clear everything up. So they came and helped and um, a few days later, LSU got, LSU facilities got a crane or a chainsaw or something like that, and they were able to get the tree off my car. The oaks are an iconic part of LSU's campus, and according to the LSU Foundation, are valued at $50 million. Tammy Milliken, Executive Director of Facility and Property Oversight at LSU, says that she feels the large oaks on campus have stood up very well under the weight of the ice storm. One of the large oaks that lines the LSU parade grounds split in half from the storm, but Milliken says that the oak had previous damage from a lightning strike that weakened its structure. Milliken says the landscape services staff will continue to examine it to determine if the remaining section is stable and to continue growing. At this time, it is their opinion that it can be left standing. Luckily, according to the LSU Ag Center, these oaks are known for their long lives and hard, durable wood. For Tiger TV News, I'm Milan Valdivieso. The down limbs as well as dangerous icy conditions on the roads caused LSU to cancel school from February 22nd through February 26th. Students are expected to make up the days that were missed on Saturday, March 6th, Friday, March 12th, Thursday, March 25th, and Saturday, April 10th.